So I had a company contact me and say that they wanted to sponsor me. That is, they wanted to send me a product for testing. So the name of this company is Dream. That is, it's spelled like Dream would normally be, but it's got an E at the end. D-R-E-A-M-E. -E. So let's see what goodies they sent in this fairly large box. You'll see um, an Amazon link in the description for this product. And this product shipped from, it was locally, Hebron, Kentucky. And they ship me lots of paper. ship me a box in a box. So you know this fairly heavy thing is uh, packed pretty well. You order it from Amazon. They did a good job with shipping to be sure. Lo and behold, there's another box in the box. Turn it around so you can see it. So here it is. Get this out. Yep, it certainly packed well. Oop, I even have a little handle here. handle that actually comes through so you can technically put it back in this box and carry it around but the product is the DreamTech cordless vacuum model T10 isn't that sharp and it obviously is like a white and probably gray color scheme okay let's see if I can get this out of the box without mangling it too much. Here's what it looks like on the back side, right there. And if I read the sticker on it, right here, it says DreamTech Cordless Vacuum T10 Model VTN1. Gross weight 12.6 pounds and manufactured by Dream Trading um, Company Limited. So, product is made in China. Well, let's see, I've got this little piece to break free here. And let's see what we got. All right, we've got a wand. So that certainly looks like that's aluminum. It's got some plastic ends, got some metal prongs here, and we have the user manual. I imagine you can probably download this online as well. Uh, mounting template sticker, so it must come in, it must come with some type of a mounting bracket. That's nice for cordless vacuums because otherwise they tend to fall over. And it says maintenance tips here. Uh, cautions, probably something like a quick start guide. All right, oh, stick it up, it's a single piece. This looks like the main motor unit. So once again, this is this is well packaged. So if you order one of these things, it definitely would have a very difficult time getting damaged in shipping. Ooh, look at that! Isn't that sharp? So, ooh, 
Okay, got a little bit of a charge. And I think, I think that may be two thirds of a charge. Here's the bin. It's shiny. I wonder how long it'll stay shiny for <laughs> once you put dirt in it, right? You hate to kind of get these things dirty because it's like, well, this looks so great coming out of the box. Got some buttons on here, some speeds. Ooh, that's high. That's medium. That's low. And let's see if I can do this right. There we go. This is a lock button right here. So you don't have to sit there and continuously squeeze that trigger. Isn't that nifty? Look at that. That is, is handy. That is really handy. Let's see, how does the battery come out? There we go. Slides out this way. I wasn't sure if it pulled out or if it slid out. So I definitely need to charge this. But that is, that is really great. That, that's smooth. That's really something. Okay, let's put that to the side. And we'll keep going here. Anything else I'm missing? All right. And now we have this other box of parts. This looks like a combination dusting brush. So that looks pretty cool. You've seen this before on other manufacturers' products. It's very, very similar. So let's see, would that fit in here? Yep, it would. Okay. I guess. And you can have a nice... Yeah, you know what? That's that, that's nice. A nice dusting experience. That, that's great. This is um, medium soft. It's definitely not harsh. I wouldn't use it for, like, say, TV sets. I'd use a microfiber. But this is, this is definitely soft. Not harsh at all. Okay, let's keep going. Ah, the charger. Here is the charger. And obviously that will charge the battery. And I imagine... Oops, I pushed the button. You can charge it from the neck right here. I don't think you can charge it with the battery removed from the main assembly. Unless they had an external charging... No. No. So it looks like you need to actually charge it while it's uh, from the neck here while it's all connected. All right, that's kind of typical. Push the button again. And last big box. Okay, we've got the power nozzle. Ooh, look at that. And I believe that I read that this is supposed to be some type of anti-tangle brush roll. And as you know, if you've been watching my channel for a while, my wife has literally two foot, over two foot long hair. So we're definitely going to test this with really, really long hair. Nice rubber wheels. Okay. Can't wait to test that. And... Let's see if we got more stuff here. So let's see. Ah, now here's a nice small tool, and you can use that like this. Great um, for stairs, but you, or, or other type of, you know, uh, like say upholstery, any kind of item that it needs to be very small and compact. I assume for the stairs that. This could plug in here as well. Yeah, see, when I do my stairs, I'm probably going to use this. I mean, I'll try them both, but I'm probably going to want the extra power of the bigger nozzle, to be honest with you, for, for larger objects. So that's great. Okay, and now we have this stand slash mount. get back to the stand here. That looks great. Um, I'll show this eventually all hooked up somewhere. So 
It comes with all the pieces you need to mount this in a closet or on a wall or something like that, which is great. Because these things, you know, they don't freestand by themselves. Okay, we have some other pieces here. See, this looks like, whoops, <laughs> it's slippery. Hey, here we go. Here's a nice little extension tube. And I imagine you can go and hook this up and maybe it's used for say like, you know, a car or whatever it is, whatever it might be that you would need to use some type of, you know, extension hose where you don't necessarily want something as long as this. So that's that's great. This this is handy. There's there's other manufacturers out there that don't necessarily send this in there. Uh, you know, you have to buy something like this separately, and that's great that Dream has decided to include something like this. I'm going to have lots of uses for something like this. Let's see what we got next, which I think this is the... I think this is the last accessory. Okay, this is the last accessory in the box. Yeah. So you have this wonderful crevice tool. And yeah. Look at that. So that's that's pretty typical. Okay, wonderful. So you've got a full set as far as I'm concerned, of accessories. So this thing can be useful for just about everything you could possibly imagine. So if I were to lay all this stuff out, let's see what we got here. All these accessories, this other cleaning head. You've got charger. And you've got this multifunction cleaning brush and about like about like this I would imagine so here's here's everything that you get of course can't forget manual and guides so a lot of a uh, lot of boxes and stuff to unpack but that's what you get also here's a little uh, package of mounting screws. Oh, so thanks again to Dream Technology for sponsoring me and, and sending me this uh, T10 to go and review. So this is the unboxing video. That's now done. And then what you're going to see is a whole lot of tests, both on bare floor and also on carpet and probably some furniture as well. Lots of weighed results. So stay tuned. And I need to plug this in and get it charging.